Hey guys, it's Annabelle. So I'm doing some videos today kind of explaining how we do things with our two kids. Um, I've gotten lots of questions as I we are preparing for baby number three to come um, for how we do things right now. So this is our bath time um, setup right now and um, we have toys for the kids so we have books for the kids we have this little basketball hoop in here um, that is all for fun stuff I got some other stuff that I'll show you too that we have for fun stuff um, another must have for us is this um, we actually just had this put in about a month ago this is a permanent non-slip bottom for the bathtub and we love it um, my son was in a bath seat just to kind of help him stay afloat um, while the kids were in the bath um, but this now that he is standing up getting his own toys out doing his own thing in the bathtub um, we definitely need this um, non-slip surface. So that is awesome and a definite must have for us with our kids. Um, the things that we use in the bathtub, we are really, really simple. Um, we do use Aveeno Baby um, bath stuff. We have the gentle conditioning shampoo and we have the lightly scented wash and shampoo. Um, that's what we use in the bathtub. Um, my daughter does use a, um, like, uh, conditioner um, for her hair and um, we just use a simple washcloth and then this is some more fun stuff that we have um, if we want them to soak in the bathtub like if they're really dirty after being like at the park or out or whatever um, we do give them stuff like with the fizzy um, fizzy tub colors um, they love those they change the water different colors and then um, my daughter also has her um, bath crayons and that keeps them in there a little bit longer um, and while um, they are um, in the bathtub. Um, I am getting all of the stuff out for them. Um, we keep their towels behind the door and um, their robes behind the door. So we've got a towel for my son, a towel for my daughter, a robe for my daughter, and a robe for my son. Um, and then I also, we have bins in here with their pajamas. And so my son just needs a cloth diaper. And we've been putting him in just a pair of shorts for night because he sweats a lot when he sleeps. So we just put a pair of shorts on him because he has figured out how to take his diapers off. Um, and then my daughter just has a nightgown and then she has little panties that she wears. So um, we have all of this in a bin in here. So as they're like playing and having fun, I usually sit on the toilet or I sit on the floor. Um, we also have a little step stool over here that I sometimes sit on. Um, but otherwise, that is how we do it. Um, their bath time is a roughly about 15 minutes maybe on a typical day unless we have like fun stuff then they usually stay in for about like half hour 45 minutes ish um but yeah so that is our setup as of right now for our kids taking baths and with baby number three um depending on if um baby number three is a girl or a boy um like right now my son and my daughter do take baths together and that will be changing once um baby number three does come um i know a lot of people don't like it that a boy and a girl take a bath together but they're still young my daughter is three and my son is one um so they still take baths together and then whatever baby number three turns out to be um they will take a bath with their brother or their sister, depending if it's a girl or a boy. Um, but in the beginning, we do have a baby bathtub for baby number three, so we will use that for a while. Um, but yeah, and then we will change bath time up. So if baby number three is a girl, she will take a bath with my daughter. If baby number three is a boy, he will take a bath with my son. But yeah, if you have any, any other questions on how we do things at bath time, just leave a comment below, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.